hate being out so close to dark. It's harder to see them coming. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little. In front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it. And that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day for food and water and gas for the stove. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. <sighs> I know. It's just hard to get Why does he sound younger? We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. This dude's <sighs> been crossed. an adult since the start of the apocalypse, and he sounds younger now. There it is. Yeah, maybe we'll have to fight zombie Hank Hill. Let's take it and go. Maybe zombie Liu Kang. That'd be tight. Empty. <laughs> You've got to be fucking kidding me! God damn it! Dude, why would you make so much noise? Of course it's empty. Why would we get that lucky? I mean, it's not like we needed it or anything. Hey, 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 don't beat yourself up about it. It was worth a shot. It just didn't work out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought, this one time, we deserve to catch a fucking break. Holy fuck. Is that a fucking jockey? Dude. Kate, you're a hammer now! Pick the wrong fucking neighborhood, kid. Holy shit! This kid's getting a fucking obliterated. Dude, you, you're not gonna be in the sequel, Chid. Chid. I was gonna say child, but instead it came out as Chid. I'm sorry. I was just so fucking scared. You, you froze. It's okay. I wanted to kill it. I really did. I, I know him. You knew him. He was one of Kate's friends. True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. That's not Drew anymore. I know, it, it still looks like him, but... The kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this... thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people, if they're just the dead... <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. Muertos. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. <sighs> Can we go back now? Nope. <coughs> we need to find propane and propane accessories. Tell you what. Pretty sure fucking Rick <laughs> beheads a zombie. He like slides his hand on its spinal cord and just <laughs> Mortal Kombat fatalities it. Could be wrong. I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back, but it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there. For an empty can. There's gotta be a safer place out there. So, we'll leave. Go somewhere else. Somewhere safer. Somewhere with crazy thick walls, okay? And a gate that's 20 feet tall. You really think the kids are gonna be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? What the fuck? Cave. We're safe inside the house. We're tired of being afraid. Every time we leave you guys alone. <laughs> and it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now. While we still can. What about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. 
Your dad would want us to do this game. He'd want us to survive. We've been surviving. Here. At home. Barely. I'm sorry, Gabe. But... Javi's right. Uh, how about... You guys go and I stay here. You're a kid. That's not how it works. Yeah, Gabe? I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just... Ask my friends. Dude, you're three feet tall. Gabe. Honey. What? What's what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? She said. Because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew, but it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean he, he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. Really not that big of a deal. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Right now. Fucking put him up, hubby. Tomorrow. As soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started. Okay? What are we going to tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Tell him we'll find him. Somehow. We're all gonna see each other again. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now. So we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really. Why are they giving each other eyebrows? What's going on here? What a perfect time to cough. She has a fucking cassette player. What the hell? Wait, grab the baseball bat. Dude, everyone has a montage of them, like, grabbing stuff, and she fucking pulls out some weed. Hey, man, I'll, I'll catch you later. Dad? Javi? Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. God, you have no idea how good it is to see your face. I think I got a pretty decent idea, actually. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need to David. Doctor. Now, David. Your fucking men killed her. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. 
Also, they killed your daughter over She's pudding. She's coming inside, but she hasn't been changed. This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No, I didn't say that. Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. Fine. Let's just get this over with. Javi. Make my job easy, would you? Listen to your friend. <sighs> Whatever you say. <coughs> Let's go. Wish this headset had a mute function. Then I could just mute and cough freely. I just cough whatever I want. Trip. Oh God. Yo, her fucking Eleanor. face morphed. What the hell? When we found the car without you in it. I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she... She needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. Well, luckily we found her before she got any worse. They just took her to the hospital. I can't believe no one went to look for her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. I don't mind. What? The people here in Richmond. Their new frontier. Oh my god. Oh, ho, ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. David was gone. I had to step up, make sure the family would be okay. It's not like I could just walk away from her, from any of them. No, of course not. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, you're- Trip, I'm not even disagreeing it. with you. Even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it, that shit can't stand. No fucking way David was a part of that. That's not the kind of man he is. Maybe he wasn't the last time you saw him, but you said yourself, it's been a while. What was he like when you knew? Did you guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. Things between me and him were complicated. Some days we'd be at each other's throats. Other days we could shoot the shit for hours and still find stuff to talk about. So he's a moody son of a bitch, huh? Yeah, basically. If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. Dude, we I all heard Badger. I'm not just going to let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. People died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. 
Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of something. Come on already. Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. Thought I taught you better than that. Lead the way. Gladly. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Jesus Christ. Trip. Just drop it, okay? Yeah, trip. Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll be back as soon as I can. You know that. Thanks. Trip, I'm on your side, buddy. You're a man and a half, and you got Jesus on your side. That means God's got to be somewhere on our side, huh? along with them for now that doesn't sound good we have a process our own way of doing things your guys better not have a problem with that things don't go well for troublemakers here I hope that's clear no problem you won't have to worry about them didn't sound that way they just need time to get used to things I hope you're right come on yeah, David. Gonna blow your brains out. Hire, hire a couple of your guys to get Where the stains out. Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe. He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? Mariana saw things that other people didn't. She, uh... She told me she wanted to write down her memories to keep them alive after she was gone. Sounds like her. Always was a dreamer. How? How did she die? Your man. Tell me how it happened. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you'll believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. Yeah, fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. They ambushed us in a junkyard. Just unloaded on us. They chased us back to this town, Prescott. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. 
Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. I can be impressive when I try. I'll follow your lead. Just don't get cute. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Oh, it's her. Who's the fresh meat? Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Well, is it now? You didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. <laughs> Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. <sighs> that means fucking Clem was directly under both of them. <laughs> that woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house at the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you for three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It was long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore. So I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside DC. After what happened to Mama and everyone else. Yo, fucking I'm gonna get some time out, dude. That's insane. But you were taking care of him, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. <laughs> we took care of each other. And we all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. Dude, I'm gonna fucking grow, grow a bullet in your skull. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. I'm not staying long. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. Yo. I'm gonna get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi. I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> you know me. I'm always okay. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Mm, she's all right. Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. I'm pretty sure you have to say that. Doesn't make it not true. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, me. Oh, shit. I'll get the doc. Fucking Gabe's I'm acting fine. like I was sleeping with I just with her. needed to talk to you alone. I ain't done shit yet. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even <coughs> when I thought I was going to die. Everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. Let's just get you better, Kate. The facilities here. I don't care about facilities. We did fine without them before. Yeah, didn't have a ruptured spleen before. These people need to kill gets me, it. Javi. David's people. Have you forgotten, Mari? Of course not. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I don't know, Kate. We were on our last legs. Javi. Whatever problems this place has, it's worse out there. For you, maybe. Whatever. Just, please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. 
Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. Hmm. I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. We got lucky. We met a group with a medic, Eleanor, just before Kate got shot. The same group in quarantine now. She's there now? We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? There's your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good carry. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. I don't trust this guy. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys, and I will handle him. Thumbs up? Thumbs up? Nope. Shit. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Mm. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> Absolutely. I feel like I'm home at last. I hope Richmond can become your home. I know David would like that. And nothing pleases me more than seeing families reunited. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden or a baked delicacy by yours truly? Everything looks so good. I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please. Forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty <laughs> strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. I always do what I'm told. Ask my older brother. You're gonna fit in well, Javi. I can see that already. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. <laughs> we had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. He trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. 
Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. That looks pretty intense. Doesn't it hurt? It's burned into your flesh. Of course it fucking hurts. Okay. It's a commitment, not a Buddhist symbol from your year abroad. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim, one worth fighting for. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. I don't have a problem with him. He's all right by me. Yeah. Same here. I don't buy it. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Yeah, we were in a fucking junkyard. Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. I did. That, that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? Girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. Well, let's judge you then. You got some colorful friends. So what if Javi met up with Clementine? It doesn't mean anything. We kicked her out <laughs> for a reason, David. Now the two of them are thick as thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not Whoa. sure what you mean. Harvey? You have something to say? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, <coughs> we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They overran Prescott with walkers, ran them in on trucks. Badger did that, not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear! David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. I can't leave Kate and Gabe alone. <laughs> they won't be alone. I'll be here to take care of them. I can't help you now, but maybe I can down the road. Just stay alive. Okay? What a perfect time to get a dive, <laughs> Mount Dew and cough.
Ooh, man. That is some good Diet Mountain Dew. Trademarked. You're lucky I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? David packed this. He did. They said... Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! This isn't her fault, Trip. You're mad at the wrong person. Holy fuck. Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. Got it. Come back. Jesus Christ, Trip. Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. We trusted you. Everything was going okay. At first, I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Yeah, you're you just gonna do it right here? Pack the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. We don't even know where the hell we are on this thing. Okay. <coughs> There's Richmond. That helps. That's where we are. And that's where we need to go. Just gotta head north. And to find North, we need to find the North Star. Dude, where's Kentaro when you need him? That's it. We need to go this way. <laughs> what else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. <laughs> no food. Let's go. Trip, come on. What's up? I can't lose anyone else. I'm telling you, I can't. You won't, Trip. Prescott, Conrad. <laughs> Rooms to flow, but it's either flow or cough. Maybe Eleanor. Knock that shit off, Trip. You're better than that. <laughs> we'll see. Sorry, man. Rough day, to say the least. I know you got my back. And I got yours. Of course. After you. I gotta tell you, man, I thought you and Kate were, you know, I wouldn't have guessed she was married to not you. I ain't judging, mind you, I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't my business, I know, but what have we got to lose out here? I... 
Hey, man, it's all right. Go for it. I do have feelings for her. And maybe I shouldn't, but that doesn't just make them go away. Uh, no harm in saying it. Hell, only real harms in not saying it when you should. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. If they're one and the same or otherwise. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just when you think you got everything figured out. Yeah, you're right. Goddamn mess. And it never quite washes out. Eleanor and I, we were... something at some point. But nothing now. I respect her wishes. I really do. Just gotta make a move trip. I just wish my heart respected mine. I wish those trees would stop phasing in and out of reality. Jesus got his eye on something. What you got for us, man? Listen. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. We better scoot. Stealth. Okay, look alive, people. I got him. Holy fuck. Jesus. God damn, dude. Fucking Man, hobby. Fuck face. Come on, man. Move your ass. You want a piece of this? Just fucking leave him. Button mashing competition. You never stood a chance. It's fucking Clementine. She was a ghost the last time I saw her. You should be more careful with this. We're even now. I thought you were getting out of here. I was. The walkers are everywhere. I had to cover myself in walker guts to get away. Come on. We're heading to a factory nearby. Should be safe. I thought you were going to Richmond. Did the new frontier kick you out? Doesn't surprise me. No thanks to David. And no thanks at all. David? That asshole's still around? Up the trees. This is gonna sound really weird, oh. but... He's my brother. What? Wait. This place we're going? David sent you there? Supposed to be safe. Clem. Clementine. You can't trust him, Javi. I learned that the hard way. This brand is a lie. It's a lie that says you can trust us. You belong. They don't care about their people. They promised they'd help him. They were going to let him die. I like how you get one clump flashback per episode. Dave and I were in this unit together back in the army. And uh, believe it or They're not, they're going to get you the medicine you need, AJ. I don't care what they say.
Oh, he looks just like his mom. I forgot her name. It's like Fred. I mean, she's she's amazing. I would I would fuck with her. Right. Ooh, antibacterial. Hope I don't have to use that. Here it is. It would have to be a shot. Yo, that's way too much. You're fucking insane. Clown. Dr. Lingard, what's the matter with you? Um, I'm fine. Clem, please don't. The vancomycin. That's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. I told you. It could save someone's life if used right. It's the only thing that can save him. Except it can't. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I... I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. Clem, put the drugs back before anyone finds out you took them. You know what they do to thieves here. I have to try. Come on, goofball. I need you to be brave for me now, okay? Shh, shh, see? It's not so bad. Ooh. AJ, shh. What the hell is this? I told her it was a bad idea. Are you fucking high again? Pull yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. How could you be so stupid? So selfish? I had nothing left to lose. AJ was gonna die if I didn't. He's gonna die anyway. <laughs> that waste? That'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough. We should have left him out in the woods a week ago. But look, it's helping. It doesn't work that way, Clown. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. I wish I could tell you it would save him. But that's the reality. Then it was worth it. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Without a goddamn thought for anyone else. You're being a real we dick, David. Arms to you, made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. You broke our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. I made the right call. One you refused to make. Well, I'm making one now. No, oh, David, you dick. Get your shit <coughs> and get out. Maybe we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Tell hey, you, Jesus? Come on, AJ. We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. Can't take him with you. That ship has sailed. Get out of my fucking way. Right now. Clem. He's in no condition to travel. Let him go, Clem. He'll only drag you down out there. No! They need to die. You monsters! What about this? What was it all for? Don't forget. I'm one of you. Not anymore. Let her say goodbye. We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Say what you need to say, then you go.
fucked up dude david will fucking get what's coming to him this is what david circled on the map our smelly friends are back Then push against this, it might give. Gotta find a way in. Here they come. I can. Uh, fuck. I can raise it a little, but I don't know, something's wrong with it. Jammed or some shit. Maybe we can force it open. We're gonna have to. We can use that floor jack to lift up the garage door. Ooh, we did this in the first game. That's a fucking insane way to fucking hold the fence. That's it. Won't go any higher. Everyone get in. Close. <sighs> Hopefully that door holds him. Hey, I'm here. David! Don't you dare let that fucking baby killer in. <gasps> Don't make me do this. Clem. Don't do it, Javi. He'll die. He deserves worse. He has a son, Clem. Just like you did. Just hide. The fuck? Open it.
What the hell are you doing here? Ask your brother. She's trouble. Trust me. She's with me. I owe her my life. She told us some pretty ranting stuff about you, man. What did she say? That you left her to die. No, we kicked her out. A little girl, all alone out there. Do you think Mariana could have survived that? We had rules. Clem broke them. I would have done the same to anybody. She knew what would happen. Don't feel sorry for her. To anybody, huh? You broke the rules for Kate and Gabe. And I'll accept the consequences. Unlike her. Did he suffer? Please. I have to know. No. I wouldn't have let him. But I didn't have to worry about that. He lived, Clem. He lived. But how? He was dying. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. It was... a miracle. You're lying. I don't know, Clem. I don't think he'd lie about this. You don't know him like I do. Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's in Richmond? Dr. Lingard took care of the boy. He'll know how to find him. Then I'm going back. None of us are going anywhere until the walker's clear. What's your plan, David? We used to store a vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. Wait. This is a send-off? You're, you're just seeing me on my merry way. You think I want this? Well, you're not doing much to stop it. I don't see another way. Shit! Board it up. Holy fuck. We need something to buffer. Something heavy. There! Help me! Up. <laughs> Wait a half second. Where'd you find this? Over there. <coughs> Show me. take them but I might be going crazy but I think these came from Prescott that's phantom punch I don't understand how all this got here like you don't know hey none of this stuff was here before I don't have a damn thing to do with it we've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts your people looted this stuff from Prescott David come on we can't know that who else knew about this place your outfit is the only one that gutted my town. This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns I heard got raided a while back. There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. Take cover. Do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? You only just realizing that now? I told you, Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. 
That shit is the new gold. Shame you can't take it with you. David! I thought better of you, Max. I really did. David, come on, man. We're a unit. We're a unit. There's no need for... <laughs> He's getting away. Oh, dude, that no. guy's head's Get gonna better. fucking pop. <laughs> fucking professional football, baseball, football. me in a fucking bun flashing competition? Nah, you fucked up, boy. You fucked up. Hobby, you're fucking trash. Dude. There was shit in the junkyard. He was not the fly in my way. If I'd have known you were Dave's brother, I'd have shoved that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. But this'll do. Oh, your fucking head's gonna pop like a balloon. You, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. I'm, I'm. This is for Mariana. She was a sweet little girl. Just minding her own business. <laughs> Not anymore. Fuck her. And fuck you too. Get it over with. Goddamn Skippy. Come on. What are you waiting for? We've got to move. Oh, I could have fucking smashed Stop. his brain. Please. Raiding, looting, you betrayed who we are. You betrayed Richmond. Come on, David. This is Richmond. What's that supposed to mean? What's that supposed to mean? There's no use holding out, Max. The best you can do is make things right. We... We weren't doing it without support inside Richmond. Joan was in on it. We did it on her orders. She... She said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm... I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. Please, don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. I'll help you get back inside. Expose her to the others. Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. Dude, I fucking I that. rung that one guy's bell. He just fucking walked away.
Where's Lonnie? He gave us the slip. Hightailed it back towards Richmond. Son of a bitch. If he warns Joan... Wasn't there one more? Oh... What? It's good riddance. That son of a bitch killed Mariana. Did that make you feel better? I wouldn't shed any tears if I were you. Maybe I'm shedding them for your brother. I thought it would at the time. Now... Now I'm not so sure. Hold on to that doubt. It means you're still human. Javi's earned my trust. And if any of you had any brains, you'd say the same. <coughs> I'm sure you did the right thing. <coughs> Sometimes there's just no other way to make things right. My friend took a crowbar to someone once. Kenny. My people need to know about what we found here. What about your missing friends? I'm surprised you care. Human life isn't exactly high on your list of priorities. Don't have time to keep looking. They'd want me to get home and warn them. So that's what I'm gonna do. Sooner the better. You sure you'll be okay on your own? To be honest, I think my odds are better than yours. I won't forget about you. You have my word. It's a shitstorm out there, man. I don't see how you're gonna make it. One step at a time. Oh, Jesus, this is so fucking cool. We need to get back to the <laughs> fast. I have loved ones in there. We both do. We all do. Yeah. I gotta break Eleanor out of there. Trip Once two. she's safe, I... I'm gonna tell her how I feel. Hey, the mess never washes out. Might as well get neck deep. We're gonna need allies in Richmond. Lingard and Clint, they're our best bet. If I can get to them before <laughs> Joan does, maybe we have a chance. I know I was ready to say goodbye before, but I can't do this without you. Can I count on you? I won't be able to pull this off myself. I'll back you up, but I'm doing this for Kate, not you. Fine. As long as we get it done. Dude. If Lonnie raises the, the alarm, they'll just be waiting for us What the fuck? Kids. There's a way in round back. Oh, that's round insane. Sentries. We can take Badger's truck. I doubt he'll mind. Come on. We gotta get on the move. Herd's closing in. Oh, yeah, the whole... Oh, my God. <laughs> The whole game's falling apart. <laughs> Coughing break. Wait, did I unmute? Yeah, it did. Thinking this will go a lot better if we split up. A group this big can't exactly sneak around, particularly if they're expecting us. Eleanor's in there somewhere. I'm going after her. Lingard brought her to the clinic. That's your best bet. Javi, that's where you'll go to get Kate and Gabe. Then bring them to my house. It's the one with the raven on the hitching post. We'll all meet up there. After I pay a little visit to Joan. Stay out of sight. They'll be keeping an eye out for us. As soon as I can get Kate and Gabe, we'll see you back at the house. Roger that. I'll scout ahead. What about you, Clem? I'm pretty sure I've still got some friends in the New Frontier. If they know where AJ's being held, they'll tell me. As soon as I find him, Taking that truck and getting the hell out of here. Well, you are owed a vehicle. Handshake. Keep Hand. an eye on David. He may be playing nice, but I'd still watch your back. I'm with you, Clem. He rubs me the wrong way. As soon as I get Kate and Gabe, 
I'm gonna figure out what's best for us. Well, I hope it involves getting far away from here. But you're no dummy. Your instincts have been right most of the time. I know you'll make the right call. Mm -hmm. See you when I see you. Oh. David said to hang a ride up at that corner. Seems clear so far. Let's move. You know Javi Garcia? He used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? That's who we're looking for? Yeah, that Javier Garcia. Anyway, sounds like some paranoid horse shit. Guy's a fucking ball player. There's the medical center. He's gonna go ninja his way back in here and stir up trouble. We go yeah, in, we get out, we get Kate player. and Gabe, yeah, we get out. Right. What about our friends there? Doesn't exactly look like a welcoming committee. All right, let's hang out here for a while. Smoke break. Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? What the fuck? Shit, we need to get the fire crew or that shit could burn down the block. You couldn't have just taken out a window. Did the trick, didn't it? Jesus. <laughs> what was that? I don't even know what those are. Are those like little batteries for the electric current to flow through? Makes sense. It would allow streets to maintain a charge. More consistent electricity outflow, I guess. Find out. Tell her we have to move, Kate. You got it. I'll meet you here. We're in the fucking ship, boys. We thought you were... I was... super worried. We have to leave, Gabe. Now. Oh. Okay. I'm sorry. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? Your dad's taking care of a few loose ends. And right now, he needs me to take care of you. Oh, okay. David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay there. Then let's go. Wait, Javi? While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. I felt like she was sizing me up. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble. Like he was no longer in charge. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but it only made me worry more. Joan's been running this place behind David's back. She's pulling the strings. What do you mean? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. We found all this stuff from Prescott. She was behind Prescott? David's rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you think it's worse on the road, but you have to see reason. This isn't our fight. We already lost Mari because of these people. Now, the whole place is about to become a war zone. The only thing I care about is keeping you safe. Then you know we can't get involved. What's going on? Tripp said we had to move to David's house. We're not doing that. We're getting the fuck out of Richmond before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? What about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe, we don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But he won't know where we are. Again! I can't go back to how things were before. <coughs> I'm sorry. I just can't. I'm sorry, Gabe. But we have to get out of here. 
If we're leaving, I've got to get some things for the road. All my stuff is stashed in the room they gave me. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds good. <laughs> Gabe, come help. I got it. Come on, buddy. I'm not going, Javi. What? I'm gonna find my dad. I have to. I'm sorry. Okay, buddy. I respect that. <sighs> Thank you. Gabe, no. Kate. No. Please, Gabe. Please. I never thought I could be a mom. I never thought I wanted to be a mom until I met you and your sister. Bitch, I'm you were talking about you dropping them off on the road and this. shit. It's my dad, Kate. I can't lose him again. And I can't lose you. Kate, come on. We have to respect his decision. I can't. Look at me, Gabe. Please. It's his father, Kate. It's what he wants. And this is what you want. What we want. We got so close in the last few years. I... I thought Gabe would want to stay with us. I really saw him as my kid. I guess he didn't feel the same way. He's growing up fast, Kate. We have to trust him to do what's right. I know. It's just hard to say goodbye. I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. I'd talk fast. Fast and clear. Easy now. We were just on our way out. That's him, right? The brother? Thought so. Bring him in. Kate, run! Oh, she's not going to make it. She's a goner. I don't like your tone, David. If this is about your brother... Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. You've got a lot to answer for. Me? You must be joking. What's this? They were trying to leave. Him and his lady friend. Leave? I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe, not tuck your tail and run. Were you really gonna desert me when I needed you most? Richmond's not safe. It's no place for an injured woman and a boy. So you were just gonna leave me to it, huh? Where are they now? Girl got away. No sign of the kid. We'll deal with this later. You smuggled your brother into Richmond despite what we agreed. Clearly, you have no respect for any of us. This is serious, David. You know we can't let this go. You don't deserve respect. Not after the things you've done. What things? What's this all about? She's been ordering raids on peaceful communities, sending your men to murder and loot. Raiding? Joan, is this true? <laughs> He's pointing the finger at everyone. First Badger, now me. That's a serious charge. You come in swinging, you better have proof. Here's our proof. This lowlife was part of the raids. I... Well, Max... 
What do you have to say? Don't be afraid of her, Max. We've got your back. Me, Badger, and, and Lonnie, we ran the ops. Off Jones' orders. God damn it, Max. I'm washing my hands of this, man. Joan. How could you? <coughs> the real question is, how could I not? What would happen to us without your fertilizer, Clint? Or your pills, Paul? Do you think our community would survive? I did what I had to, to ensure that we would. It wasn't easy. So you survived. But at what cost? Do you even know how much suffering you've caused? I've no doubt it's less than I've prevented. All of you remember the winter. How much we lost. Friends. Lovers. Children. I made a promise I would never let that happen again. The raids were just to keep us going till Richmond reached sustainability. We're so close. So close to our dream. Do we really want to risk it all by fighting amongst ourselves? We should all be on the same side of this, David. On Richmond's side. Surely you can see that. She's fucking delusional. Building a dream on the blood of innocence. You don't have to tell me, brother. We lost Mariana to those raids. How many others lost their kids, too? I'm sorry, David. It breaks my heart about your child. It's... It's something I'm going to have to live with. Dude, she doesn't even give a fuck. Take them. What the hell? Put them in the cell until I can figure out what to do with them. Don't you fucking touch me. That's an order! They don't take orders from you anymore, David. You're done here. Oh, dude, this place is you finished. Put yourself before the group. You won't get away with this, Joan. All of this will come back on you eventually. Paul, come on. I'm sorry. My <laughs> hands are tied. This is not over, Joan. I have friends here. Allies. Okay, I'm just going to call it quits there. As good of a place as any. <laughs>